right, today we're in the London Borough of Hillingdon with Miriam. Thank Hello. you for inviting me. Now, tell me, what do Hillingdon ask you to do with your, with your waste? Well, they asked me to recycle in this uh, special bath. And here at the front, they have written it is. It, yeah, what uh, it can be put in the bags. It's very it's clear, written. isn't it? Yeah, it's very clear. Okay. And then across the things that shouldn't be put in the, inside the bag. Okay. So that's how very good. we go for paper, plastics and things like that. Yeah, very complicated. But not food waste, unfortunately. Not food waste, no. Okay. I haven't been given anything for food waste. Okay, fair um, enough. Okay, so and the back bag. That bag, yeah. that bag, that's just my rubbish. Yeah, the bin. you can't recycle. No, I can't recycle that. I just need to buy the special rubbish bags and yep. put them in the bin. Okay. Yeah. And that, if you did have any, was... Yeah, this is for garden waste. <laughs> so you haven't got any this week? Yeah, they come and collect it every other week. Okay, um, very yeah. good. And this... Yes. Those are our bottles, that's glass. And we but they don't, take, they don't take glass? No, they no. don't take okay. any glass and we right. have to do it ourselves. We right. have to put it, uh, we recycle and take it to the dump and we okay. put it in a different um, you know, places for glass, for green right. or white. Or and you're happy to do that? Yes, we do it regularly. Well, more of my husband. Well, I, I, I think the reason that they don't collect glass is because if they collected it with the paper, the glass would break and contaminate the paper. Well, yeah, I so, that, yeah. And the fact that you've gone to the special effort of doing your own glass mm. is, is very good. I still think it'd be really nice if they could give us containers for the glass. Yes. You know, yeah. Uh, separately from the bags. So, okay. Mm. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> now, Miriam. Yes. I happen to know you weren't born in London. No. I'm going to lay this down to you. And you don't know that much about cars, do you? No. <laughs> but fortunately, Philip does. Now, Philip, you were the first person that told me I didn't need to get rid of my 10-year-old car. That's now, right. can you explain that, please? Because I don't think people understand that. No. Well, it takes a lot of resources and a lot of energy to build a new car. So if you can keep your old car running, it's much better for the environment and uses less resources than constantly buying a new car. Because our, our car is, is 10 years old and it's had a dent at the front and a dent at the back, not at the same time. And Phil at Wilson Green Garage with his bare hands has pulled out the dent and kept it going. And I've just got the MOT here for the car, it's just passed. And they test for exhaust emissions and I'm, I'm reassured that if it's got the MOT, it means it's not a heavily polluting car. That's right. Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you for that. Now, I've got your figures here. Now, Hillingdon are fifth in London with a recycling rate of 40.9%. But your household's done better than that. And you were saying you do the, you do the minimum. I don't really so. make any special effort. No, I just the use the bags and things that they give them. us. Okay, very good. Well, here's your here's your figures. You're recycling that big huge bag, 6.3 kilos. Glass, 2 kilos. Landfill, your recycling rate is 55%. So, congratulations. Thank you. Well done. Thank you.